I don't want any plastic. I don't want any ground floors. And I don't want to get married in Everett Alley. Do you understand that? I want to do what I want to do. Back to my YouTube channel. If you are just now clicking on this video, this is the first video I've ever seen. My name is Lucy, and I'm so excited that you are here today. Make sure that you guys subscribe, follow me on Instagram, and follow me on TikTok if you haven't already. But I'm very excited for today's video because I haven't talked to a camera, guys, in probably two weeks. Like informally, I have not spoken to this camera and catching up with you guys. One part of that is due to my procrastination because for the last three days I put off filming uh, this video. That's just my own fault, to be honest. Like. I tell myself that I'm going to be like filming one day and then I'm like, no, I'll do it tomorrow. And then the next day I'll be like, oh, I'll do it tomorrow. And then here we are. The other part of it is that I've kind of been more in a creative rut lately. And I think it's because I posted three videos in one week and I just really overdid myself. I just needed a little bit to calm down. So thank you guys so much for understanding because I have not posted in a hot minute. Something that I've been thinking about that has been on my mind lately is that I never know what to film. And I'm not saying like, I don't know what to film film because there are a million things to film that I could film for you guys and I just like have tons of ideas in my head but there are just like some days where I want to vlog and I just want to talk to the camera but I'm like don't want to just sit here you know I think it's just like my own self criticism uh, that I just think that my life is the most boring freaking thing in the world you guys always comment and tell me all the time that you just want to see me do like the mundane things I don't know going to get my coffee and something so simple as that and I'm like are you guys lying to me because I honestly don't think that that is interesting but uh, you guys like it so I'm gonna take you guys along with a few days of my life because I actually am doing something and I always do this where I plan something fun I do something fun and then in the middle of me doing that I regret not filming because I'm like like not thinking of it and I just hate that for the first time in a long time I'm actually being proactive and I'm telling myself that I have to film and take you guys along with my days and I'm just gonna show you guys a few days of my life realistically we're going to be productive we're gonna do the workouts it's almost summertime and I just want to be the productive so self-growth, baddest bee that I can be before summer. Since I've been in a creative rut, I think the worst thing that I could do for myself is just sit indoors all day. So I really want to take the opportunity to get outside. So I'm ready to get the day started. I'm actually waiting for Joe to get back from grocery shopping because he's getting a few things. Joe is actually FaceTiming me right now. <laughs> Say hello. <laughs> I'm trying to figure out if you got some mail with me. Hello, That is a male pepper. I think that's funny that you called me because of that. One's sweeter than the other one, I thought. The female one is. Found <laughs> one. I was just telling the vlog that we're going to take a walk and we're gonna go on a little date. Yeah, we are. Sit. <laughs> <laughs> she sounds like a cat. Yeah. So I'm actually as a puppy. It is the next day now and I stopped filming yesterday because all we did basically was come back home after our little dinner date that we had and sat on the couch and just cuddled and watched YouTube videos. Definitely needed that little date because I just feel like it's super important, especially if you guys live together, if you are with a significant other to still plan dates. It's just really nice to spend quality time together. So that was just really nice and I'm really glad that we did that yesterday. But today is currently Friday. I just got done with work and I'm about to get ready to get on a brand call. I actually have a call and I have to just go over some things for a collaboration that I'm doing. And I really hate to be that creator to be like not be able to tell you anything, but you guys will know the brand deal either before I post this video or right after. Make sure you put your post notifications on so you guys are up to date on all of my videos. Other than that today, I really want to go to the gym. I really want to make this a more productive video and kind of just get back into my routine. Honestly, I've kind of been in a creative rut lately and I have been slowly incorporating my habits 
habit to get back into the swing of things. That includes going to the gym, that includes actually getting ready for the day, like actually putting forth time to take care of myself in the morning, brush my teeth, brush my hair, and I know that sounds so weird, but sometimes I just felt like I didn't want to do it. It is actually so important to actually just get ready for the day if you aren't even planning on going anywhere just because it just makes you feel energized, it makes you feel like you want to be productive, and it just makes you feel better. Definitely something that I've been incorporating. the gym and to be quite honest with you I haven't gone to the gym well okay I did go to the gym about three days ago but all I did was go on the treadmill and I came home and I did an ab workout in my backyard which honestly is ideal but it is raining outside so I have to do my full workout at the gym it's currently 5 30 and I'm probably gonna spend about an hour and a half at the gym I'm just going to try to focus on doing an actual workout I just want to get ready for summer there's only like 40 so days until summer starts so I definitely want want to have a hot girl summer but here is the fit I definitely didn't even realize that I am basically all monochrome in this like pastel yellow color but honestly I am obsessed with it my sports bra and leggings are from set active which I totally recommend if you guys haven't tried set active definitely you need to my water bottle is from Target and my gym bag is from Reebok so let's go to the gym So as I'm starting to ease my way out of this rut that I've been in, I found that my mood is significantly improving when I prioritize working out and I've known this for so long and I don't know why I keep going through the cycle of dropping out of working out. Even though I may only have two to three times a week to actually go to the gym, I have been taking a lot more walks since the weather has been so nice out lately and also stretching in the morning outside in my backyard before I start work. It really makes a huge difference and even though I couldn't go outside this day, I still listen to my body and completed a workout that I enjoyed and it made me feel better. I always dread coming to the gym but I never once regret it when I'm finished because I just ultimately know that it mentally makes me feel so much happier. back from the gym and I just finished eating my dinner. Currently in my bathroom, I was actually about to take my makeup off, but then I realized that I have to actually run to Target and get a birthday present for a birthday party that I'm going to this weekend. And it's a good thing that I remembered because there is literally no way that I could do it tomorrow or even the next day because the birthday party is literally on Sunday, which is in two days. So, so I have decided I'm going to run to Target. This is the outfit, I guess, because I just need to go and they're gonna close soon. But anyways, let's go to Target. Oh, 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 oh,
So I am back from Target and I got the birthday present that I need to get, but I also picked up a few things that I just wanted to show you guys. I just got a few things for my skincare routine that I just needed restocking in and then something else that I really didn't need, but I just want to get anyway. I just got some of this Panoxyl. This is an acne foaming wash and I recently tried this a couple months ago and it literally is so good. So if you guys have acne or just like hormonal acne around like your period, because it's pretty much what I had trouble with, start using this. I swear it works so good and it's the only thing that actually clears up my pimples. And then I also picked up some of these Mighty Patches. I really love these. They just work so well. I don't know what I was doing before pimple patches. Like, I don't, I don't even know. I also just picked up some ribbon because I want to make a cute little bow for the birthday present. Last but not least, I picked up for tomorrow because I'm going to have a really long day tomorrow. I decided to pick up two of these Alani New. This is their new one in the Rocket Pot flavor and I'm very excited. I'm actually so upset that I cannot try this right now because... I've heard very good things that taste really good. So now I am going to sit here and I'm going to edit for the rest of the night probably for a few hours. It's currently almost 11 o'clock and I'm probably going to stay up really late tonight just to edit. I'm going to have a really long day tomorrow so I want to make sure I go to bed at a decent time but usually on the weekends I end up staying up until almost 2 a.m. some days so that's just how I roll. So lately I've been listening to Manifestation Frequencies on Spotify and there's a ton of playlists you can just search them up but I'll have the one that I listen to all the time linked down below and I just love listening to this in the back of like when I'm editing videos or journaling and it's just so relaxing and it honestly just like makes me feel really good so I'm gonna turn on that playlist 